Glad you're safe, lad. Got out just in time. Pretty sure I burned my bridges in Asgard, though. Wait, why were you out here? Sindri told us where you would arrive should you find trouble. Oh, thought you might have been exploring without me. No, lad. Your dad was just concerned. Though, now that you mention it... Mimir. Brother, please. It's all so crowded and tense back home. Don't you miss the three of us out finding our own adventures? Putting off the inevitable. Exactly! It's not the worst idea. I do want to show everyone the mask, but it'll keep. Hmm. Back, everybody. Hey, you made it. I'll get to here. Back. Do you want to set the table if you're ready to oh, stay? See? I told you the key would get him home. Because you tapped oh. it with a hammer. Dwarven magic makes no sense. Right? Lunda one time made me a breastplate out of dog barks. You're back. I still can't figure that out. Are you okay? Out. I'm fine. I just hope unlocking this thing was worth the cost. You have it. What did it show you? I didn't get to use it. They found out about Heimdall. I had to run. But at least Odin can't use it either. But if you didn't get any answers from the mask, all you've done is steal Odin's greatest treasure. Just after your father's killed his most loyal ally. None of us are safe. Even here. So we have no choice. We find Surtur, sound Galahorn, and bring Odin to justice. Now. You'd incinerate every soul in Asgard and call it self-defense? Does he ever suggest plans or just crap on everyone else's? The obvious plan is staring you in the face. We don't need Odin to use this. We can slip into Asgard and do it ourselves, right under his nose. We gain the knowledge we need to shatter this prophecy of war once and for all. Except begging your pardon, you don't have a way into Asgard. They got the big horn, don't they? Oh, so you expect them to sneak into Asgard, blowing a horn that sounds across all the realms? I expect you to bite my blue butt cheek. Please, just think about it. This mask, the easy answers that it promises. I know this. Shortcuts always have a price. Atreus, you have carried it. What do you think? I think it's a chance. At worst, we'll have something Odin wants as leverage. At best, if it really gives us all the answers, then we can make our own path. And nobody has to die. Hmm. Grand. Now all we need is a way to Asgard. <laughs> hmm. I know I've been a burden to you all. I know you've questioned why you even pulled me out of that hole. I have to, but it's clear now. This is what I'm needed for. This is my purpose. One last time, I will pick up my spear and I will lead us to Asgard. Excuse me, but if you got a way to Asgard, where's that idea been this whole fucking while? That's not that a fair question, brother. You was held as God. You would have gotten us all killed. And we needed to give Loki time to find his destiny. Here it is. It's all led to this. If we can get inside, I'm going after Odin. I will not stop you. We can do both. Spot on, brother. If the mask doesn't give us an out, we'll still have the drop on him. <laughs> Works for me. Let's do it then, and quickly, before he sees us coming. He does hate surprises. Slow down, you damn spruce. I still want to hear the details on this uh, new way to Asgard you got. Spill it! It's an ancient path. We can't reach it from here. Where then? Let me collect my things and I'll show you. You ain't got no things. And where are you going with that mask, rock? That belongs to the kid. He earned it. All you done was make passable dirt soup. Brock, it's okay. No, it ain't. This ain't right. 
All the pieces ain't welding together true. Like, what's with him calling you Loki anyway? You know that ain't his name. Hey! I'm talking to you! You never shut up! Run! Of all the things, Odin. Let go of the boy and face me! Tell your brother to throw me the mask and you've got a deal. Stop moving. Freya, if he dies... No, no. It wasn't part of the plan. But if he dies, we are square for Heimdall. And honestly, you got a bargain. I will kill you. Plan on that. Mm -hmm. So nice spending time with you again. Freya, please. Uh, uh, uh. Can't be in two places at once, Frigg. Hey! I don't move, you don't move. Don't do anything you won't regret. I regret many things. Killing you will not be one of them. Lose my son! I am in control! Here! Throw me the mask! Now! Too bad, son. Looks like war after all. Please, you have to save him. You have to. He can't. You can't. Maybe if I go back to the lake. Stop it. I know what you've done, and I forgive you. But you gotta stop. You gotta let go. Bro. This whole time. So, uh, what do we do now? Now? Now we kill Odin and anyone who gets in our way. Truth. What? Where? It does not matter. Where are you going? We are done. You can't run away from this, Kratos. Odin won't stop until we stop him! We need you here! Father, where are we going? Father, can we? I... I want to go hunting. I will follow. We are with you, Atreus. What do we hunt? Deer. Which way we headed, lad? In... the direction of deer.
wish to speak of what happened? I think I heard something. This way. He just needs space. Here. Tracks. They're leading that way. Atreus, violence changes us. You are not weak to feel its effects. We're all feeling its effects. We're heading the right way. There's broken branches over there. Come on. I keep seeing it. The knife, Brock, Sentry's face. Son. There it is. See over speed. Why? That was running. And so are we. I don't understand. When an animal is wounded, it must stop the bleeding. It will die. We have been wounded in this. This is a distraction. It's my fault. No. Find Sindri. I have a pretty good idea where he might be. Lead. <laughs> Is it okay if we take the sleds? I need to think about what I'm going to say to him. Of course. <laughs> Everywhere I look, I'm reminded of my mistakes. Our actions have consequences. To be reminded of them is not punishment. Feels like it. If I had just... Seen through a deception that fooled us all. Stopped an attack you could not predict. There is no if, Atreus. Your father's right. There are things even gods cannot control. Take the sled when you're ready.
Pierce Temple. That's where we're headed. Mimir, is there a chance that we could bring Brock back? Sentry did it once. Maybe we could figure out a way to do it again. I'm afraid not, little brother. When a soul missing its full gear, its direction, like Brock's, leaves its corporeal form, well, it can't reach the Lake of Souls. He's not only dead, he's been denied an afterlife. There's nothing to bring back. It's really gone. Atreus, if there was anything we could do, I promise you, we'd be doing it. I know. It was stupid of me to hope in the first place. I miss when the lake was still water. I feel like I want to get on a boat and just sail away from here. From everything. You cannot sail away from your mistakes. It is impossible to forget them. I have tried. I will follow you no matter where you go, little brother. If you want to sail, do it toward somewhere. The lift at the end of the bridge should still work. We can get up to the temple that way. What makes you so sure Sindri will be here? It's where he and Brock reunited. Reforging something that broke. He'll be here. Sindri, I... I am so sorry. No. I... No, I don't want to hear it. You don't know what sorry means. We're not letting Odin get away with this. Would that be the Odin you invited into my home? We were all fooled. Oh. But some of us were bigger fools than others, aren't we? I gave you everything. My skills. My friendship. My home. My secrets. My treasures. And you just kept taking. And now what have I got? <laughs> Not even my family. If you want sorry, this is what sorry looks like. I... What can we do? We... There is no we. There's only you. No matter what the cost. So what you can do... is get the fuck out of my sight! Come on, Chase. There's no 
making this right. Is there? No. But I know I'll feel better when we brought order to justice. Justice? Justice is not what we seek. It is vengeance. Every path on board leads back to vengeance. Maybe that's all we have left. We must return to Freya. When we get back, where we really are going to war. It has come to that. Yes. When we were back in Svartal Farm, looking for Tyr, this isn't what I wanted. This wasn't what I meant. Not if you ah! meant losing Brock. We know Atreus. We know. We really took everything from Sindri. Don't take to heart what I'm said in grief, Atreus. No matter how spot on they feel. I know we should go see Freya. But... I wouldn't mind staying here in Midgard. For a little while. Aye. A few last adventures to take our minds off the stable. Everything. Sure, Freya will still be at the house. Don't see why not. Odin's back door in was also his way out. Without the blasted raven apparently hiding in the broom closet, the house should be secure. And she will not turn away allies in her vengeance. Aye, it's all our vengeance now. And no more fake Tyr to twist our minds around. Oh, what a mockery he made of Tyr's desire for peace and mine. You're back. To you all. I do love Are you with us? Other matters mm. under the circumstances. Good. It's time. There is a favor time for I must what, did I ask? Time to unite the realms against Odin once and for all. Tyr tried to unite the realms. The real Tyr. Everyone loved him. And even he failed. Then we better not fail. Or there will be no one left to try. This is Ragnarok. And Odin's already heard every blasted plan we have. Yes, we've lost the element of surprise. More than that, we have only one way to Asgard, and it's not subtle. Go on. It means we enter from Tyr's temple, here. Asgard's wall is here. Odin's host of Einherjar will hold the space in between. Which means... We need armies of our own. As many as will answer the call. Numbers Odin won't see coming. And that's just to reach the wall. To breach the wall, we'll need to find Surtur. Radatoskar was able to procure this. The three of us will go. I know just where to look. Mm. Splendid. Allies, then. Who do we think we can get? I'll venture to Helheim. Try to recruit the army of the dead. And I'll return to Alfheim to unite the elves. Just like that. Unite the elves after centuries of war. Well, they really like me in all fun. And you? To Valheim? Yes. To find Sigrun and muster the free Valkyries. Midgard has no army. Nor Niflheim, nor Jotunheim. That leaves only Svartalfheim. I'll go to Svartalfheim. Sindri? Are you sure? I said I'll go. So be it. Good luck to us all. Off 
to Muspelheim to find the last fire giant. I almost envy everyone else's impossible. <laughs> said you know where to look for Surtur. Yeah. I unlocked the secrets in the shrine when I was in Muspelheim with Thor. Thor? Don't worry. He didn't see me go in. That was not my worry. Now look. When we find Surtur, we'll have to convince him to combine with his wife, Sinmara. Combine? Yeah. When the two of them, uh, join, they'll create an enormous Asgard-destroying monster. Oh my. Apologies. I have some doubts regarding negotiations with Rosvelger and Helheim. My thinking is that she may be more amenable to speaking with a member of the, uh, deceased. Mimir, you're needed. Oh, death is a skill now. I suppose these two can survive a bit without me. Brother, if you wouldn't mind. Very well. Many thanks. We'll catch up with you later. Hey, I think I can see Surtur's forge in the distance. Surtur's wife. Where is she? Niflheim. I think. <laughs> Heads up! Yeah. It avoids every attack! <laughs> I wonder if they saw their prophecy and decided to isolate themselves in their home realms to fight it. Understandable. Hopefully they'll understand why Ragnarok needs to happen now. Look, over there. Might be past this lava fall. You know this. A hunch. When I was here before, I got a pretty good feel for the layout. We need to be ready for Surtur, in case he doesn't want to help us. Ready? Prophecy says he and Sinmara join. But who knows how they're gonna feel about it now? You would try to force these primordial beings into submission. Well, I don't know. We can't win this war without them, right? We gotta be close. I can hear the force. Something ahead. Be ready.
Ignoring us. Come on. Hello. We seek a fire giant. Go away. What just happened? Hey, that wasn't. We deal with these fuck. Another one? Focus. He is the guardian of this realm. It is his right to defend it! You're on fire! But you probably already know that! Watch your right! Why won't you help us? I don't want to. Elaborate. We'll die. Right. Because you've got so much to live for. Not me. Her. So what's the point of all this? You keep separate from Sinmara just so you can... Sit here and wait to die? At least if you joined with her, you'd be together again. We are together. Not her heart. She's got mine. It's not much, but it's enough. But you're not even... Have you ever been in love? It's pretty good. And Odin will succeed. And all realms save Asgard will fall. Well, he must die. It's true. But I won't sacrifice her any more than you would him. Sorry. Wait. Those blades. May I see them? Hmm. Yeah, it's pretty. 
primordial fire in those. They are not of these lands. Shouldn't matter. Yeah, that could work. What could? Put those in here. And I'll become your monster. But I don't want her involved at all. But the prophecy says you two have to combine. I'm sure this will work? What have I got to live for? Not here. Follow me. Where do we go? Spark of the world. Which is? A place where Niflheim and Muspelheim meet. Where the first realms came into existence. You won't be able to get through this, huh? Whoa. Uh, starter? Still me. Better than walking. What awaits us at this spark of the world? Magic. Primordial stuff. With that, and your blades, and my heart, we'll be good. I'll get it. Big. Smash stuff. You'll like it. But what'll happen when you change? Dunno. Won't be me anymore. But how will you, or, um, future new you, know when to attack Asgard? You got the horn. Right? Yeah. Then we're good. So, here it is, the spark of the world. Whoa, this is beautiful. I'll meet you across. This feels too easy. Odin knows we have Gal Owen. He knows you have the mask. After killing Brock, he knows we would seek Surtur to start this war. But what other choice do we have? None. He knows that too. about Sinmara? Should we at least tell her? No. It'd hurt her too much. More than not knowing what happened to you? Sometimes loving someone is about choosing the lesser pain. That doesn't make any sense. I promise you'll stay away from her. You have our word. Sorter, is stabbing you with the blades gonna be enough to create this new you? Sinmara's heart is cold. So beautifully cold. Your dad's now got my fire in those glades. If enough of me and the sparks fire go into enough of her, it should work. Okay. Come here. Oh, 
fire. Her heart. Combine them. You get Ragnarok. It's time. to gateway back from there.
worked. I can't believe it. We got Ragnarok on our side. Sorter's plan just worked. I mean, the Valkyries were a small setback, but I bet we've got Odin worried now. He knows we're coming for him. Think about it. We're gonna show up to Asgard, and Ragnarok's gonna come in and wreck everything. Odin won't stand a chance. We're gonna win. Gro was right. Gro failed to predict what we would sacrifice in return. Maybe she could only see the big stuff. This is gonna work, right? It must. Ragnarok strength grows. Hey, check out that cliff. Earthquake must have shook this place up enough to make the light. More of Odin's forces. Trying to finish the job is not reloaded. This way, Father. We can climb back towards the gate. So, you fought in a lot of wars, right? You've never had anything like Ragnarok on your side? I have. And the creature does not guarantee our victory. Right. place is going to fall apart if those keep happening. Quiet. I mean, you're always quiet, but this feels different. I had hoped my days of ceaseless battles were over. I had hoped to never see my son go to war. <laughs> Ragnarok is here. They 
know what that means, man. Behind you! Incoming! Father, I know we're doing the right thing. Ragnarok has to happen. The price we and others paid for this war is high. It will only get higher. It'll be worth it. Father, how did it go? And yes, my usefulness to a certain Vanya Numpty did run out. Ragnarok awaits our call. As do the armies of hell. Thanks mostly to me. It seems war is upon us at last. Where to now, brother? We've some time before we're expected at the temple. This could be our last chance, father. Is there anything you want to finish? Well, this is it then. The beginning of the end. The end for Odin. And after that, a new beginning for the rest of us. Atreus. I know. I'm just looking forward to seeing all the realms finally standing up to him. Elves and dwarves and hell itself. You are so certain they will unite. They have to. After everything they've been through. They have to. Don't they? <laughs> Anything in Midgard you want to do? You know. While we still can. Freya and the others are still making preparations for the attack. So there's time. Another Berserker gravestone. Brother, about the oracles of your lands, would you say they manipulated events? Did they have an agenda? I do not doubt they held their own interests first, but in my experience, they could be easily fooled by their own prophecies. But enough of that for now. Okay, ready when you are. All the armies are probably gathered in their home realms, waiting for when we blow Gallarhorn. Guess I was kind of hoping to see some of them here. When all the realm towers open at once, we'll see plenty, lad. Odin won't believe what's coming for him. No. Odin had lifetimes to prepare for this. Whatever grows deception, he heard the truth as tear. Do not underestimate him. Rousing speech, brother. Very inspirational. Wow. The Valkyries look different. Welcome back. Hildesfini informed me of your success. We've been planning accordingly. Well, what would Ragnarok be without Ragnarok? Who else agreed to join us? I see the Valkyries. Better than that, they are reborn. Corporeal and uncorrupted, thanks to no small amount of Vanir magic. They're shield maidens now. Nice. And your brother? He came through. The elves called a truce to unite against Asgard. That gives us an advantage by air. And with Hell's army for a vanguard. What about Sindri? Will the dwarves fight? We haven't heard from him. But there's time yet. And I think we have what we need to clear a path for the Ragnarok beast. Well, when you say it like that, why worry at all? Sigrun! It's good to see you so... alive. Oh. Yes. I wasn't myself when last we met. I'm glad you're safe. My queen, the shield maidens will be divided among the forces breaching from Alfheim, Helheim, and here in Midgard. We stand ready. Kratos, Atreus, Mimir. 
please excuse me. Oh. Good night, then. Freya, have you determined our path out of Asgard? If the towers are the way in, we count on them being the way out. And if they are not? Then we all know what we signed up for. Our plan is only missing one thing. A leader. That honor is yours. You have a righteous claim. And the respect of your troops. And you have faced this enemy before. I held his invading army to a stalemate. This is our invasion. A siege on his terrain. I want our most experienced wartime general in the field. I don't care about the honors. I don't care about the prophecies and champions. I just need us to win. Freya. I know what I'm asking. Just... sleep on it? Here we are. Kratos, your tent is to the right, and Atreus, yours is to the left. Mine? A young warrior needs his own space, don't you think? I do. Wow. Thanks. Sleep on what we spoke of. Let me know in the morning what you decide. Excuse me. May I have a moment with Mimir? I don't know what tomorrow brings, but if tonight is our last night, I'd like to spend it feeling something besides hate. Will you tell me one last silly story? There's nothing I'd like more, except perhaps a dance. Yet do I may have lost a step. Do you respect love? I don't tell silly stories. You only tell silly stories. <laughs> I can never argue with you. Can I sleep here tonight? quiet your mind. I can't. Then I will tell you a story. If I fall asleep, promise you'll finish it tomorrow? Dude. 
down the logs as he could no longer bear their weight. And he, he called for death to come to him. And when death arrived, He's the only one who ever got my highbrow sense of you. Damn fine woman she was. Apart from her taste in men, of course. She was a special woman. She wanted to protect people. She was here. She saw every step we took before we took it. Like she was always with us. Watching over us. Leading us home? Does my request upset you? Death <sighs> is a natural part of life, my love. I wish only to be prepared for when my time comes. We mortals must do such things. I am glad to have you prepare with me. You are quiet? I have nothing to say. Well, say something. I enjoy hearing your voice. A funeral pyre. I would have chosen different. Oh? Mm. In my land, we entomb our loved ones. You would have me trapped in the ground for eternity. I would have you close to me. How touching. My rotting corpse would bring you such comfort. You once tried to take charge of your ending, did you know? That was different. Circumstance, yes. But not on purpose. to better a future that will exist without me whenever that day comes. 
for you and for our son. We will always walk together, Kratos. You will always be a part of me. I will always be a part of you. And when you are gone, that a part of me dies as well. Do you feel your absence? No. <laughs> Culmination of love is grief. And yet we love, despite the inevitable. We open our hearts to it. When the pyre is spent, and you have gathered my ashes, spread them from the highest peak in all the realms. You will do this for me. to have loved fully. Open your heart to the world as you have opened it to me and you will find every reason to keep living in it. What's going on? It is time. I'll meet you outside, Father. Sir. you one more time, my queen. Me too. But not as your queen. As sisters. Are you ready? Yes. I will be your general. It will be an honor to fight alongside you, general. Aye, brother. I'll be right by your side. So, what are your orders? To the temple. 